So this is an advanced preview on basically what Snow Leopard 10.6 is going to be. Just to show you, there it is, it's build 10A380. Uh, I'm running on the new aluminum MacBooks, uh, not the newest, newest ones, which are now considered pros, uh, but just one of the general MacBooks aluminum. Um, some of the new features they added are like the stacks, which I personally dislike this. They added a scroll bar. I just preferred to have everything visible at once. And, but like one of the features that I really find useful and stuff is like all your folders that are inside of your applications or something. You can just click them and it goes into sub, like subfolders. Then you can click it again, just go back up here. It also added a little border around it, which not all that great. And it's just another little feature. Uh, I've tested most of the applications from my uh, Leopard. Um, about one of the few things that doesn't run is crossover games, but um, the developers are working on that right now. And pretty much all my games work, all my stuff previously, except for a few things that they've taken out compatibility because it's Snow Leopard and it already has that stuff. Um, QuickTime 10, they've added new features, like right now I'm actually using the screen recorder option um, to record all of this. And I previously used an application called uh, Snap Tools Pro or something like that, um, which actually costs money. And more than likely, the screen recording stuff is going to be QuickTime Pro, um, not included by default. That's my guess. Uh, they've also added a couple features into the Finder. If I can, uh, let's just go right here, and it's not showing it for some reason. But yeah, right there, there's a little play button. You can just hit that, and it will start playing like the song and or video preview. For QuickTime, it's pretty much got a new uh, interface. Um, here's a, basically it also, with the video thing, if you, you can do the same thing, but it doesn't really work as well. Because it's just tiny little window unless you were to make it full size. It's not really for watching videos. But QuickTime, it's got a new interface. It's Basically when it's playing a video, as you can see like the top close buttons and all that, just they go away. Um, it's got the like chapter view, like I can skip ahead to like chapter, which say 15, and then just play from there or go to there. That's if your movie even has chapters, a lot of movies don't. And you can add it to your iTunes library with a direct click right there, and then full screen, of course. Every version has had that except for Windows versions. It, in general, I like Snow Leopard, and it runs a lot faster than uh, Leopard and Tiger. But it's still got some bugs and stuff. I haven't really found much that, in the way of bugs that needs to be reported or anything. Just like improvements. Like, I think they should go back to the old style... Um, uh, right, yeah, the old style. What? It, God, I can't think of the name right now. Uh, yeah. <laughs> quick look really hasn't changed. It's still the same old quick look. Um, really, it's not much in the way of new looks, new style. It's really for speed, performance, and a few new features. But, and that pretty much shows most of the visible features. But like hidden features are like, for instance, the um, system is now 64-bit, which gives it faster um, support and allows it to run on more RAM. Like 32-bit uh, Macs run on a maximum of 4 gigs of RAM, which I don't get how they sell the other ones with like 32 or whatever, like the Mac Pros with like 32 gigs or whatever it is. Um, they... S I don't think it utilizes it properly, but like right here, 64-bit Intel, those are all 64-bit, but all these ones are just standard previous ones. Uh, they've also got a thing called, like I think it's Grand Central Station, which is also not visible. It, uh, it allows applications to utilize your 
dual core CPU a little bit faster along with your um, GPU can use to accelerate just average processes such as iTunes and stuff. And that's about it. So if you want to comment on this or anything like that, that's all.